This new pope, taking his name from the patron saint of the downtrodden, the impoverished, St. Francis of Assisi. Many Catholics here hope that Pope Francis does what his namesake did, does what the pope did when he was a cardinal in Argentina, give hope to those who live without it. Eyewitness News reporter Tim Fleischer here now with that story. Tim? And Bill, many are now looking to Pope Francis for inspiration, but one volunteer with a special organization in Fort Greene, Brooklyn, already sees him as an inspirational guiding light. Offering mass and daily prayers in their tiny chapel, the missionaries and volunteers of Hearts Home think too of Pope Francis. Well, as a humble servant who had just received a very heavy mission. He's taking on his shoulders a lot and he cannot do it on his own. Mm -hmm. He needs the support of his people. Natalia Fasano, who devotes her life to the missionary work of this Catholic organization, sees a kinship with Pope Francis in more than just their Argentinian heritage. She helps the poor and disadvantaged here in Brooklyn, much as then Bishop Bergoglia did in Buenos Aires. He did not want to live like in this big house for bishop, but he preferred to have like a little apartment. Living out of the now shuttered St. Michael and St. Edward Church, Natalia and others live in the same Brooklyn community where they provide support for over 200 families. It requires a lot of humility from us, but that comes naturally because they are the poor, are real, I don't know, are real teachers. Cardinal Bergoglia had visited a Hearts Home in Buenos Aires in 1990. Coming away, Natalia says, with a connection of his own to this group. Thank you for being who you are. Thank you for just walking the streets of Buenos Aires and being a sign of hope. Connecting with residents where they live, like the nearby Ingersoll houses, Hearts Home offers compassion, community, and prayer, and now Natalia believes the inspiration from a new pope. We don't need to, to do great, great things, but the little one that we can do can make a difference. And Hearts Home volunteers believe that difference is made right in the communities they serve. Bill?